How's it going? Just thought I'd do a quick video of, uh, of the, uh, the game room since I got the place cleaned up a little bit for the most part. This is uh, the JAMA cabinet where I test uh, whatever little JAMA boards I get in. Right now it's running a uh, Time Pilot 84. Uh, despite what the marquee says, this is actually my Robotron project. Still in works. So a little more light in here. There we go. Yeah, she's rough but playable. So that's nice. Space Invaders, decent but not playable. Still working on that one. The uh, Galaga. It's running a uh, Galag bootleg board set. Um, so we got over here the <laughs> the Cherry Master. Uh, picked this up for cheap, like five bucks for the cabinet. Bill Acceptor works. Uh, got some cheap boards. Just waiting on a monitor and bezel. And uh, I have a Cherry Master. Be jealous, yeah. Uh, the Miss Pac-Man Mini. It looks a little bit different than any uh, the last video you might have seen her in. Uh, actually got a uh, another control panel for her with smart work. The other one. Oh, uh, there we go. The other one was cleared off and spray painted black by the guy who had it before me. So I'm happy to have this. This is uh, was given to me by Dell from Chattanooga Pinball. Thanks much, Dell. Heading over here to the other side. It's the uh, the ice cold beer and the golden tea cabinet. Everybody's got to have one. This one is actually just home for the monitor until I need the monitor, and then it's coming out. Uh, used to be a main event cabinet, and uh, picked this up for 50 bucks. So can't complain there. The, uh, the quintessential uh, pole position project. Everybody's got one. Pole position. It's always a project. Uh, even if you have a friend who has one and it's running, trust me, ask them. It's a project. Uh, beside it, over here in the dark where you can't really see. Um, you won't be able to see that. Trust me, it's a little uh, crazy Kong cabaret. And the new guys that I just brought in yesterday. Uh, haven't got them moved anywhere yet. The Galaxian. <laughs> I know she's a looker. The Galaxian cat. This is how this is how uh, people like me get machines. They look like this. Uh, the Battle Zone. Thrilled to have this one. I had to take the footy off to get it inside. Thrilled to have this one. I can't even tell you how happy I am to have this. She's not running yet. Um, you can see in the bottom she's uh, a little dirty. Uh, that's about uh, 15 years worth of laundromat uh, funk in there. Give you an idea. That's a Miller Yellow can. You might not recognize that. That's how they used to look. It's been there for a minute. Pretty much, uh, pretty much complete. Hey, there's me. What's up, me? Uh, in pretty good shape. The only real big issue is missing it. I have to get it. And the soon-to-be Multi Williams cabinet that used to be. Hold on, I know you're trying to guess what it used to be. Hold up. Yeah, it used to be Hypersports. Um, so converting it back over to a proper Williams cabinet with a Multi. Gonna have the Multi, not a Multi Cade. They're gonna be playing Miss Pac-Man on this thing. Gonna have the Multi Williams board set from uh, J Rock. As soon as they get a hold of them, get one order. J Rock, you got an order coming in. Um. I guess pretty much all I have inside right now, there is a jukebox and a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles machine out in the carport right now, which I have to bring in. The jukebox didn't uh, fit in, which we found out the hard way. So somebody has to replace the door hinge. That's me. So I have to get her inside and uh, hopefully get Space Invaders working in the next couple weeks and I'll have a, a hopefully a decent room down here for, for play-ins. Anyway, that's pretty much it for now. I just wanted to uh, do a quick video since I actually have. Look at this. If anybody has ever seen this place, this is crazy. Look at this. You can walk, granted, not very far till you run into the, the monitor graveyard over here with the boards and pieces. This is what everybody collects arcade machines. This is what the place looks like.